What's up, everybody? My name is TensBubba13, and welcome back to some more GoldenEye with Bubba, season number four. I believe this is episode number four. So, we are playing some Outpost today. Um, I'm actually decided to switch back to the Kalos, which is the assault rifle. Uh, I haven't really quite used this gun for quite a while, but you'll see later on in this gameplay, I kind of want to switch to the sniper rifle. Simply because, in particular in this map in general, uh, even in the GoldenEye Reloaded version, like there's a lot of people who snipe, and I feel like the needs to switch to sniping, like I think I do it right around here. Not so sure. There we go. <laughs> so I immediately switch to the sniper. Well, whenever I die, which I think is like right around here. So, or maybe not. But anyways, um, what I kind of wanted to talk about in general was that I've been thinking about doing this new series not really sure if it's gonna be like anything but I'm calling this episode Road to Strata and simply because that I am currently level 44 and I'm only like a couple more points away to unlocking the Strata so this may or may not be like that long like I'll probably do like a couple games in between like each episode just so that I can get some experience like in between each parts so whenever I explain to you what my progress was, then I will just simply go over that in each of the episodes and kind of just give you some discussions about this and that in general. So my road to Strata is going to be kind of short since I'm a little bit close to achieving that goal. And uh, I know how much I really want the Strata. It's like probably like one of the best SMG guns, like the best if possible. So, you'll see a lot of people who have it, like, at level 45, already experiencing it. It's just a, such a crazy gun in general. Um, so, I can't wait to unlock the Strata. And so, probably what I'm going to do in this episode is just kind of talk about, like, my progress and what my current status is like. Um, I believe right now I'm at almost 6,000 more points away to unlocking it. And the, the one thing I also want to kind of talk about, and especially, is, like, leveling up. In general and like how it is compared to the gold like golden eye reloaded and the Wii version so if you play through both the versions and you'll probably notice this as you level up higher and higher that it really takes a while I think in most shooting games in general I can kind of say that is that they take a while to level up especially in golden eye we I feel like right now it's been really slow for me since like from time to time I don't do great in most games but when it comes time to like games that you know I either joined with, with my friends or if I just joined up with like some people that are really good then those times you're gonna probably just end up getting like a probably 100 to maybe more than 100 points probably even more than that depending on how like skillful you get like how many skills and all that stuff at the very end of the match like most of the time my goal especially is to get the first t uh, victory point, uh, be the be the leader of the team, like have the most kills on my team and everything. You'll get a lot more points just by doing that. So if you can kind of do that, that's really amazing. You'll probably rack up a lot more points and such. Um, so that's generally what I go for in some of these gameplays is like try to see if I can get like to the to the best of my team. But that most cases that doesn't really happen, and I think in this gameplay I don't really get first in my team. I don't think so. For, you'll probably see me most of the time not really achieving the goals that I really wanted to, to for each gameplay. So that's one thing I can really give you if you really want to get more points. And other than that, I think also is just using the weapons more often, uh, especially in GoldenEye Reloaded. Like in GoldenEye Reloaded. Uh, there's a way to get like attachments and that requires you to use the guns more than a few times per match uh, Generally speaking like if you kill like a lot of people with the let's say The Sigmas and you want to get like attachments for it Then you basically want to use that for like the majority of the beginning when you first get the game probably until whatever attachments you need for the gun that really makes it better uh, and that really just, you know, adds points to the uh, to the skillful level of the gun that you're using. Not really necessarily like anything. You'll probably get some points when you like master the the weapon completely. 
And I guess that's another thing too for Goldeneye Reloaded is that you'll get a lot of more points when you level up. And to me, I feel like Goldeneye Reloaded does a pretty decent job with that. But when it comes to the Wii version, I feel like it's going to take you a while for you to get what you need. Especially like later on when you reach level 40. Or maybe even lower than 40. Uh, just saying that because <laughs> those, those are probably one of the better weapons that you'll probably spend more time with once you finally unlock those. And probably when I get the Strata, like, I bet you I'll probably be like maybe racking up some points with the Strata. Like, it's, it's pretty decent. I, I really just like the Strata. I picked up a few Stratas here and there, and I try to see if I can get the highest achievements for it and everything. So, that's pretty much what I'm aiming for. And you actually do the same thing. It's pretty much the same as it was in GoldenEye Reloaded. You'll probably get some achievement points on mastering the weapon completely. And I believe I'm kind of getting close to mastering every kind of gun, especially except for the guns that I haven't really unlocked most of the time and I'm not even sure if I'm completely done with all of these snipers uh, there's still a couple of snipers I haven't unlocked in this game uh, I haven't unlocked the WA-2000 I believe it's called and the Gambit sniper rifle those are the only two uh, snipers that I'm missing for this game and there's a couple other assault rifles that I'm missing I believe the Ivana spec is the only one that I'm missing I could be wrong I haven't really checked it's been a while since I checked my recent guns that I unlocked so I may be kind of wrong. I think the Ivana specs the last assault rifle that I haven't unlocked, I believe. So that's kind of the last thing on the list of guns I really need to unlock. Uh, the shotguns, I'm pretty sure the Master Tin is the only one that I haven't um, unlocked completely. I think that's the last uh, shotgun that I haven't touched. But I really don't care about the Master Tin because it's really just an OP. It's an, it's such an OP weapon. Like it's. It's uh, a semi-automatic shotgun that does about like maybe five rounds, I would say, and it's really strong, especially for farther distance. You'll kill them like pretty decent. It's it's amazing. So that's kind of what my status is at the moment. Uh, also, I am joined with Alex again from the last episode, Goldeneye, um, for the Wii version. So shoutouts to him. Don't know if he's a YouTuber, but go check him out if he is. Um, and pretty much that's how it's going to be. So next time I will probably continue my journey through the road to Strata. And hopefully I'll see you guys next week. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.